Welcome everyone to my first Unisig EFP playthrough. This one is going to be very difficult. Now to explain the reason why it's going to be difficult, we're starting in outskirts and I'll explain why that's bad once we get in game. As you can see, hard and survivalist and let's see about my loadout. So I'm going to take the weakest armor possible and I will explain why once we get in game. I will also be taking the best backpack I can because I am tired of being weighed down. I also need both IFACs immediately. I definitely need a lot of ammo because as you can see, we actually start with two weapons automatically as Unisig. All right, there we go. As you can see, this is what I'm going with mainly this crappy armor the big backpack two IFAX and then the rest is ammo and this gas mask so hopefully we'll be good and the name of our guy will be phantom let's go ahead and start all right now one thing you're going to notice instantly is uh yeah we start all the way up this apartment building and yes there's monolith over there and there's monolith over there so uh yeah in a great spot however the one good thing is that if we go in this room right here as you can see we have some purified water and here we go two more weapons got a mauser and right here for some reason a monolith ibaz suit now i don't plan on using this suit at all so that's not really important but let me go over our plan real quick if you didn't already know, when you start up north, the places that you can't go due to the Brain Scorcher still being on is obviously Pripyat. We can't go to Red Forest. We can't go to Lamont. So how in the world do we get down south without dying and frying our brain? It's actually somewhat simple. We go through Jupiter Underground, come out over here in Jupiter, and obviously there's going to be monolith in our face. So that's the dangerous part. And there's zombies in Jupiter Underground. But we make our way over here, and you might notice there's a new transition. This is from the Redone Collection. It's a new way to go from Jupiter to Lamonsk. And it takes us out right here, which means all we got to do is run down here, and then boom, we can go to Dead City. So we do actually have a way of getting down south, but it's obviously not going to be that easy. Now, the reason it's not going to be so easy is because obviously in Outskirts, there's a ton, a ton of monolith and then jupiter underground we have to worry about zombies and snorks and then once we get out of jupiter underground there's gonna be monolith in our face so yeah this is about to be an insane adventure and for those wondering the reason we need to make our way down south to begin with is because in order to begin the unison quest line we do have to go to this building right here in darkscape so uh yeah our first goal is to make our way all the way down south from all the way up north wait did i accidentally start with fmj plus on one of those oops i meant to just do fmj but that's okay all right, now I'm pretty sure I can just go down these stairs all the way down. I don't have to, like, go on the vine. Oh, okay. I, I did not know there was a, a thing right there to just drop. You know, if I was smart, it would probably be better to just go ahead and equip this IBAS because that would help if I ever get shot. But at the same time, I hate being slow. So the smartest idea, in my opinion, is to probably just go down here to the mercenaries and see if maybe they have some more ammo I can buy or if we're, um, you know, able to get some quests. Because as you can see, we should be friends with them. Yep, we are friends with mercenaries. So just go ahead and set waypoint for down there and I guess let's start heading there. Yeah, once we make it all the way down south, this is the first ever Unisig playthrough I've ever done, so it should be quite interesting because I've never done the main quest line, and I did just hear a anomaly activate in there. Oh, I think it's just an artifact activating it. Got to be really careful. Oh, oh, no. Oh, I see monolith. I see monolith. I'm trying not to waste ammo. Sorry, guys. I'm just going to run. They're not shooting at me for some reason. I don't know why, but I did just catch them when I turned around right there. Nope. Just gonna run. Just gonna run. We're gonna be fine. We're fine. Oh, that's not fine, though. Oh, crap. Oh, I'm gonna die already. <laughs> Can you imagine if I was doing Iron Man or freaking <laughs> Invictus right now? That would have been so bad. But hey, at least I know there's like Monolith right around the corner now. Yeah, maybe I'll, I'll try going further down this way. I just don't need to get too close to where the lab is over there. But maybe if I go further this way, I can avoid the mutant altogether. All right, so far so good. I mean, like, we're, we're doing a pretty good job sneaking our way down here besides that one death. And I am playing the game quite a bit slower than I would otherwise normally. Now, unfortunately, if you can see this, I did have to get rid of Arrival because Arrival was ca causing me pretty bad FPS problems. So, as you can see, we're back to dynamic anomalies again. Oh, little rats. Did I just miss? There you go. I don't want to shoot too many bullets. Now, here's the laundromat, and obviously I can't go in there because we're not friends with loners. The major thing about Unisig is obviously we need disguises, which early game we don't have. But I will be getting a Merc suit once we make our way into Jupiter. I'm kind of hoping that the mercenaries give us some quests that we can actually do here in Outskirts, mainly because I would like to buy more ammo if possible, just to be safe. Because there are a lot of zombies down in Jupiter Underground. 
All right, so let's see. Yeah, so it's right over there. I just want to take a little peek in here and see if there may or may not be anything sitting on the ground. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Oh, I hear dogs. Yeah, they're like over that way. Yeah, let's just uh, let's just go this way. We need to save as much ammo as possible. Ooh, mercenaries, I'm here. Don't you guys love me? Hi, how's it going? Oh, come on, you guys don't have anything like sitting around? Come on. I'm really hopeful though that these guys are gonna have some quests that I can do, hopefully. All right, let's see, please. Oh my God, Lost Signal Wild Territory. I mean, I'll grab whatever you give me, but I can't really help. And then Monolith Jupiter at the Cement Factory, great. Great, I'll accept it, but I can't really do anything about it. So unfortunately, yeah, they didn't give me what I was hoping for. But on the bright side, I can obviously buy some stuff from him, assuming it's cheap. All right, I've got 15K. I think it would be okay to buy 30 more bullets for my M4A1 just to be safe. Oh my God, I just realized I don't have any bandages. I am so lucky I just noticed that. I literally have no bandages. Okay, yep, just go ahead and buy like four. That's most of our money right there. I find it interesting they give us a universal weapon cleaning kit to start with. That is so weird to me, but you know, that's pretty cool. Well, since they didn't give me any quests, I guess it's time to start phase one of my plan, which is unfortunately to go into Jupiter Underground. So let's just go ahead and set that waypoint. And here we go. I'm gonna try to go the same way that I came here just to make sure I don't run into any dogs or anything that I don't want to run into. I mean, there were dogs like right here, I think, if I remember correctly. Oh, 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 hi. Hi, hi, hi. Um, hi, would you, lies, if, would you guys like to come with me? Come with me, come with me. Let's go to the mercenaries. Maybe you can kill them. Or, oh shit, I'm out of stamina. Uh, uh, am I? Oh my God, I'm overweight, I'm overweight, I'm overweight. Oh, hide, hide behind here. Um, sorry. Wait, why do I have 20 purified water? What? All right, I think I just figured out why I'm freaking way down so much. All right, guys, come on, come on, help me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. how about you guys go out there and uh, kill the monolith for me? Come on, please. They're coming, they're coming. I hear them. I will help you, I promise. Or did the monolith give up? Hello? Wait, I don't hear them like running around anymore. Did they, did they literally just give up? They're like, yeah, you know what? He's not worth it. Wait where, wait, wait, where did they go? I swear, I swear I just heard them right here. Where, where? Oh, there they are. But yeah, he's like running away. There you go. Come on. Help me, boys, help me. That's right, get him, get him. That's right, shoot at him while I drink coffee. Good job, my man. Oh, oh, dude. I feel bad for him. Oh wait, what did I just get hit by? Wait, I think he, I think the freaking mercenary in front of me just shotgunned me. There's no way he had to have shotgunned me because the other guy did not hit me. Well, this isn't what I was expecting to happen. I guess this is what I get for being cowardly. The game said, yeah, this is what you get. You know, this isn't working out as well as I was hoping. There's like a lot of them dying. Oh crap, that guy's alive. Oh my God, I didn't notice that Moloch was alive. I was about to get blown up, guys. There you go, he's dead. Any more? Uh, obviously there is, because they're kind of aggroed. Ooh, a lot of point forty-five ammo. That's what I'm talking about. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, there's still more. Jeez, why is there so many guys? There you go. Got him. Oh, no, 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 no. Dude, there's like no way I actually just missed that much. Holy crap. Either A, my iron sights are off, or B, I'm just that bad. Oh wow, explosive resistance, that, that's amazing. I'm so glad I got that artifact. That is absolutely amazing. Yeah, that was a, a lot more guys than I was expecting, if I'm being honest. I originally saw four, and yet we killed a lot more than that. Oh, chemical resistance, once again, very good. Okay, I, I'm gonna have to drop some stuff because I'm like weighed down pretty heavily right now. Would I rather keep, you know what? I don't really need this gun. Uh, ooh, wait, I can't disassemble it, that's right. You know what, the trigger's not very good on it anyways. Here, we'll just like uh, remove all and then uh, drop it. 
Also get rid of this freaking improvised explosive device because that's what I totally need on me right now. I feel like there are situations where that would help a lot, but like it weighs a lot considering, you know, how early I am into the game, right? So, wow, 308 for that. That is uh, quite amazing. Giving me lots and lots of money. On the bright side, I actually did get a lot of 45 uh, ammo. So that's really good. The real question is, do I just equip this Ibaz suit? Uh, you know, I'm already going slow. I might as well just go slower. Who cares? All right, there we go. I put on the uh, monolith suit. All right, let's hope that was the only group of monolith. The only thing I'm curious about is that guy who came here last that we killed was like all the way down there. So I wonder where he came from because that's kind of where I need to go. Uh, I hear something growling. I 100% heard growling. Please don't do this to me, game. Just let me get to Jupiter Underground. Like, I'm telling you, I 100% heard growling. The one thing I do need to be careful of is there's almost always dogs in this area over here, which is fine. I can kill them quite easily. And I do have quite a lot of point .45, so. All right, well, there's the laundromat. So all we got to do is sneak around back, and then we can go down to Jupiter Underground, and then we can really begin this mission. <laughs> it's going to be so bad. I'm just, like, saying it right now. It's going to be actually so bad. All right, no one can see me in the laundromat. You guys can't see me. I'm just going to come over here real quick. All right, hopefully we don't end up getting stuck in the underground for an hour. Let's go. Oh, wait, can I? Okay, I'm trying to be careful. I've I actually, I don't think I've ever gone down this way before like this. Hello? Where's the transition zone? Oh, okay, there's the zombies. I was going to say I heard walking and it got me really concerned, but then I remembered, oh yeah, there's zombies down here. Oh, this is going to be a problem. Oh, this is going to be a problem. I knew this was going to be a problem, but... This is actually going to be worse than I thought. I forgot some of these guys down here have freaking exo helms on them. Yeah, this is going to be a problem. Oh, no, I'm dead. Okay, uh, yeah, we're going to have to uh, start with our gun out. All right, let's try that again, but this time, I guess, waste my FMJ because they do have exo helms, so... You know, it would help a lot if I actually was good at aiming. Like, just saying. If I could actually aim correctly, I don't think this would be that big of a problem. What happened to my freaking global elite in CSGO back in 2015, dude? What happened to my aiming skills, dude? Getting old done screwed me up, dude. I'm too old. Oh my god, I run so slow in this water. That is insane. I already run slow, but that's like crazy. Oh my god. Yeah, there's a lot of zombies down here. How much ammo do I have in this? More than half? Okay. Alright guys, can you like start pushing please? I don't normally encourage pushing, but like I kind of want to kill the uh, exo dude. Really? 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 There's no way I'm wasting this much uh, ammo, am I? Oh my god. I get it. You have freaking Exo Helm, dude. That doesn't mean you're OP. Jesus. Jesus, I'm such a bad aim, but I think that's most of them. There should still be a couple back there. I don't think this is all based on the X's on my minimap. I think there should be more. But hey, at least some of these guys will have decent loot on them. And by decent, I mean like a bandage. Okay, now here's a question. Do zombies count as like mutants technically? Because it probably is a better idea to just put HP in my pistol. All right, before I loot these last couple of guys, let me check around this corner real quick. Because normally there's a guy in this like little room right here. 
Uh, so if there isn't, I'd be surprised. Oh, well, I guess I am surprised. Huh, okay. Normally there's a guy just kind of sitting in the corner right there. All right, well, they're all looted. So now we just have to worry about my favorite enemy in the world, also known as Snorks. And uh, there should be one right up ahead. Normally he comes from underneath that grate alongside a couple of rats. Or is it just gonna be rats? Oh, there he, oh no, wait, is it just rats, huh? Okay, I'm actually kind of confused about that because normally there's a snork that comes. Huh. Okay. Oh, there's more zombies. I was trying to wait. Oh, oh, <laughs> dude, I didn't see him. I didn't see him at all. I just assumed it was just that one guy because I peeked around the corner and only saw one dude. So I was like, oh, it's one guy. All right, let's let's uh, let's be a bit more careful this time. Just boom, and then, oh, okay. I, I kind of started spamming bullets right there because I wanted to make sure he died. Ooh, I just got a freaking uh, padlock toolbox. I mean, I do have some lock picks, I thought, right? Yeah, I got two. Let's see what's in it. Wow, a cobra sight, canned tomatoes, and a broken detector. Uh, quite amazing if you ask me. Okay, now here's the part I need to be really concerned about. And the reason why is the first time I was here, there, okay, well, it looks like we're good. Cause I would say the first time I was here, there was no one. But then the second test I did, there was a bunch of monolith just chilling in here. But I don't see no one. And that's good. Cause that means we can go over here and loot this real quick too. See if there's anything up there. Yeah, so far so good. This hasn't been as difficult as it was when I was testing stuff. It was actually way more difficult. I really shouldn't be jinxing myself because I know how this game works. Now that I have opened my mouth, it's gonna do something really annoying. You know, I'm just gonna grab this experiment notebook. I don't actually know who you even turn that into, but I'm just gonna grab it to grab it. But yeah, I'm just slightly confused because that tunnel back there, normally there was a snork in it, but it didn't have any this time. Because remember, once you leave Jupiter underground this way, it's gonna take you right into where Monolith are down there. So that's gonna be very fun. You know, these snorks are like really confusing me because I haven't seen a single one so far. There's supposed to be one up here. Is the game just like not working today? I really shouldn't be complaining about like no snorks, but I'm just confused, you know? Oh, oh, well there's a snork and it almost killed itself. And there goes a rat. Oh, another one just killed itself. It like ran over the, oh, there it is. Oh, hit it in the head, nice. Anyone else? No? All right, there should be, besides that. Oh, wow, it dodged me. That's kind of messed up. There should be one more snork in this room right here, or two, it's either one or two. There he is. I, I shot him in the crack, dude. There you go, he's dead. Man, I am playing so much slower. We are almost an hour into stream already, and I have just barely made it through Jupiter Underground. Holy crap. Here, let my stamina go up all the way. Gotta make sure I'm in good health, because there is probably gonna be Monolith through here. This way. Okay, that was an interesting noise, but three, two, one. I knew it. Yep, there's Monolith. I just need to run through, though. So I killed one. I hear, I hear footsteps, I hear footsteps. I know there's another guy. I don't know what that noise is that's like freaking out. And I really shouldn't be looting someone, but you know, you know how I am. Oh, there he is. Here, come on, come on, come up, come up. Oh, wait, wait, dude, he scared the crap out of me. I actually thought someone shot me from behind. Okay, look, I know I'm bleeding. I know I'm injured, but I'm just gonna keep going. I need to see if there's anyone out here. Okay, there isn't. All right, all right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's get going, we gotta run. All right, patching my leg up. Dude, look at how slow I'm running. Holy crap, dude. Oh, 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 okay. There's Monolith right there. Um, hi guys. All right, none of you guys turn to the left, okay? Like, as long as you guys don't look towards me, we should be safe. Did you start with an ACOG? No, you do not. <laughs> I did not start with an ACOG. I, I really wish I did. It's in my bionic slot. <gasps> oh, what? I have a freaking ACOG, dude. This entire time? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I actually started with one, but it's in my... Dude, that's, that's so stupid. Why was it in this slot? 
I actually thought I didn't have one. All right, now that we're in Jupiter, let me talk about my plans because obviously, you know, we can't go to Yanov. So what we're gonna do actually is come up here at this little checkpoint because up here, there's actually a model of suit that I'd like to grab. It's on a roof. The most annoying part though is with this Ibaz is just how slow it is, dude. Like, look at my running, man. I, I am freaking speed incarnated. Yo, yo, snork, snork, snork. Are you kidding me? Jump, don't jump at me. All right, we're in a pickle because there's monolith like in front of us. There's monolith to the side of us. There's monolith behind us. Like, dude, we are straight up in a bad situation. Okay, there's a lot of gunfire up there. And I know for a fact there's a monolith up there. I was hoping there wouldn't be that many. But do they see me? Bro, they do see me. Are you kidding me, guys? Come on. Nope. Nope, you guys don't see me. Come on, let me hide. Nope, nope, nope. I'm getting down in here. You can't shoot me. Nope, you can't see me. Okay, yeah, this is bad. We, um, I might drink a Hercules because I need, you know what, screw it. Let's just go ahead and do it. I really need the stamina recovery. Oh, hi. You know, I never knew there were so much monolith up here. Like, holy crap, dude. They're everywhere. Oh, dude, there's another guy. Oh, the game's lagging. How dare the game, like, stutter literally right as I'm aiming my gun. Okay, there's, like, one monolith ahead. Dude, what's with all these monolith here? And they're actually, like, guarding positions, too. That's crazy. Are you kidding me? All right, well, I screwed up. Oh, oh, I definitely screwed up. All right, well, crap. Now that... Oh, great. Now he's, like, rejoining his comrades. Crap, crap. Now they see me. Are you kidding me? Dude. Oh, I am such in a pickle. I'm in a pickle. I'm in a pickle. All right, yep. I'm in a pickle. Are you serious? Dude, I, dude, I didn't even move, and they already are shooting at me. Holy... All right, don't see me, don't see me, don't see me, okay? I'm on the ground, don't see me. I'm just gonna back up, I'm gonna turn around. The issue is there's monolith down the hill that were chasing me, so they might be coming up the hill right here. So, either way, I'm in a bad position. Okay, so they're going... Oh my god, I see even more monolith down over there. Oh, dude. Oh, this is such a bad position. All right, I might wait for them to keep going to the left, because if they keep going there, then I can probably... I'll probably sneak past them. If I re-equip this, yeah, I'm overweight, but I can run a lot faster. Let me see if I can drop anything. All right, there we go, there we go. Okay, I'm underweight now, I'm underweight. So now we can run a little bit faster because see, this is a uh, 105. Oh wait, hold on, before I do that, actually, let me, uh, where is, remove insert, there we go. Uh, let me put this crappy insert in here, there we go, just to be safe. So maybe it'll take a bullet for me. Uh, now there are, yep, a bunch of monolith right up ahead. So, yeah, we're going to want to sneak past them. I just don't know. Yeah, no, the, the that squad went that way. So, I'm going to I'm going to have to go around by going down. Hopefully, the squad that was shooting at me down here have like decided to move on to somewhere else. Dude, I don't think I've ever played this game as stealthy as I'm having to do right now because early Unisig without a freaking <laughs> without a disguise is like is so bad right now. Oh, all right, dude. I get it. You're hungry. Go ahead and eat some tomatoes. You deserve it, man. By the way, I'm going to give everyone a warning. When I do go through Lamonsk, the screen will be very, very blurry because of the side damage I'll be taking. And oh my god. Wait, it's ecologists. Are you serious? There's ecologists down there. There's freaking five of them. Are you, are you kidding me, guys? Oh, no, they see me. Dude, how come these guys see me from like decently far away? Wow, they, they are very bad at aiming. Like, I know I'm bad, but like, they're, they're missing like every shot. Where's the other guy? Oh, right in that bush. There you go. Yeah, see, I, oh, I forgot there was five. Oh, yep. See, he's not gonna miss. Nope, as soon as I insulted. Dude, I don't know where he is in that bush.
Really? That takes like an entire mag? Just for you, dude, because you're special? There you go, whatever. I wasted some bullets right there that I didn't need to, but who cares? Oh, wow. Look at all of the crap this guy had. Holy. Okay, it was really worth killing them, actually. All right, no one's up here, right? Right, right? No one who's going to see me? Come on. Come on, just let me let me go through Lamont's. That's all I want. I'm going to have to drink that energy drink right before I go through Lamont's, though, because I'm going to need to be able to like run as fast as possible. All right, so all I know is that I go down here, and then uh, that should be the zone. So let's just uh, drink this and run all the way down here. Hopefully, there's nothing else in here. Wait, is it not down here? Oh, it is. There we go. For a second, that scared me. It's going to lag a bit, but we're okay. We're okay. So as I said, the screen's going to get really blurry. Trust me, I hate it too. Uh, all we got to do is run and we'll make it to Dead City. So it's not too bad. I can't see my screen at all, but we'll be fine. Yeah, it's just going to keep getting worse and worse. But luckily right here is Dead City. And we still have, what, 70% of our Psy? So that worked. But see, it wasn't that bad to get down south now, was it? Hey, buddy, how much would you give me for this since I can't sell it to the ecologist? Eh, whatever. That's good enough, I guess. I found some old documents. Yeah, that's right. He, he'll give me 7K for that? That's actually not bad. There we go. Ooh, camelback and some injectors. Okay, that's not too bad. I don't really need the camelback, though. I don't really have anything else in my belt slot, though, so I guess I could just put it there, because why not? Actually, no. That weighs a lot more than I was thinking, but 9% stamina recovery. That's not bad. Uh-oh, you need the docs for Hernandez later. I mean, if I actually need the documents, I'll just, like, reload then. That's okay. After documents, garbage, sure. What I should do real quick is go up here because the medic should have some stuff in his room. Yeah, he always has this guitar, which you can sell. And then besides that, ooh, see, look, there's uh, painkillers, antibiotics. Nice. That's why you always come up here. Aha, very, very funny, Aslan. Eliminate the target in Rostock. Yeah, dude, I'll just go to Rostock real quick. No problem, bud. No problem at all. Ooh, wait, I forgot this guy can take me places. Your only option is the... Oh, yeah, he can take me to Zatan. I forgot about that, man. I forgot there was even a dude here for that. All right, now, really quickly, I know that there's more mercenaries across over here in Redone Collection, so let me... Wait. Wait, what? Wait, there's... Oh, there's also bandits, and they don't like me. I forgot, you know, mercs and uh, bandits are definitely friends. Originally, I was going to grab that merc suit that was on top of here so that I could disguise myself as a merc and that way I would be friendly with freedom. But since I didn't grab that suit, I'm kind of in a pickle right now. There you go, got both of them. Oh, Jesus, dude, what does he have? Holy crap. You hear him? You know what? Yeah, no, screw it, screw it. I don't need no freaking bandit suit. I don't need nothing. We'll we'll just make our way all the way down there. We'll be fine. We'll we'll be fine. Oh, but first I need to sell this guitar. I was like, why am I way down? And then I remembered I'm carrying like some dumb stuff right now. Oh, he doesn't want the guitar. Are you serious, bro? How come you don't want the guitar? What about you? You don't want the guitar either, dang. All right, now we're, we need to remember this. I'm gonna drop my stuff off in this little stash right here. I will totally remember this. I should probably keep the, the like, model of Ibaz on me. You know what? We're playing EFP. If I die, it's typically in one shot. That suit really isn't going to help me that much. The, the, the only issue that I was going to say, by the way, I have literally no clue how I'm going to get into uh, Dark Valley because that's kind of what I plan on doing uh, is to go from Army Warehouse to Truck Cemetery. And I was thinking, okay, I can c hug this wall and come back down here, but there's always duty here. So I'm going to have to like try to sneak around them and in redone collection it seems like there's always no matter what a dude guarding down here for some reason so like i i'm definitely gonna have to fight duty in order to uh make my way to truck cemetery yeah so i turned up stalker population by 50 percent i turned up mutant by 25 percent so uh yeah if i ever die to like a bunch of people that's the reason why it's because of my own mistakes the reason i did that is because i complained last series that efp with redone had like very few people the funny thing is, I'm running, like, all the way down to Darkscape to start the main quest, but I'm pretty sure the first mission he gives you is to, like, run all the way up to the Mercs, if I remember correctly. So I'm basically just running all the way down just to run all the way up. Okay, I don't see no one down there. The real question is, is there anyone right here? Oh, there is a guy. There's a duty soldier. Okay. So let's try to sneak kill him, because as long as I stealth kill him, no one will be alerted. So let's just go, uh, boop. No one heard it, right? 
As long as there's no one else down here, that should be a stealth kill. So no one should be alerted. Oh, there's a there's another duty over there, but I don't know if I want to shoot him or not because I don't know if he's gonna see me. I don't want to risk like not insta killing him because if I don't insta kill him, then he's gonna alert everyone else. All right, I'm just gonna like instead of shooting him, I'm just gonna like try to be stealthy. It's okay, it'll be fine. Ah, oh, crap. I'm surprised he didn't get alert. Oh. Oh, he's like right there. I was like, oh, dude, I hear a bunch of guys. Ah, oh, crap. I messed up. Dude, there's like a ton of radiation. Ah, uh, dude. See, as I said, there's a bunch of. Oh my god, look at how many duty soldiers there are right here. Oh, dude, this is this is impossible. Oh, dude, I messed up by turning up the stalker pop. Oh, wait, where, what am I shooting at? Where is he? Oh, there he is. All right, technically it's not impossible. As you can see, I did just kill them all, but like, yeah, no, I messed up by turning up that stalker pop. I really shouldn't be looting them. I should just like run. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just run, just run, just run. Oh, nope. I ran into that. That's my fault. That's my fault. All right, I'm just gonna just like spray on these guys. Bro, how, how does he, like, live all those shots? Alright. Oh, dude, he got me. Where is he? Where the fuck is he? Where is he? Is that him? Yeah, that was him. Crap, dude. I, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm like severely radiation poisoned. <laughs> dude, why was he all the way up there in that bush? That's what got me really bad. Yeah, and then there's those guys over there. This is going to be really difficult. Yeah, we're going to try a different plan. I'm actually going to see about maybe going down here and killing this guy and then just kind of sneaking up and then go around like that. If I go around like that... It should be a lot safer. You know what's screwed? I'm just gonna sneak up. Are you kidding? Sure, let's let's do your route. Let's do your route. I don't think this is gonna work out because of how many duty are there. So I'm just gonna run back to Dead City, go through Yantar, and then see if that works. I'm trying to think whether or not I want to sleep or because I do think it is easier to stealth at nighttime, I think at least. I'm not actually not 100% sure if that's actually how it works in Stalker. Bro, there's another bandit there, dude. Why why are there always uh, bandits over there? I really don't mean to be like mean and kill these guys, but I kind of have to. Oh, there's another dude in there. Oh, that's that's his fucking dude. That's Linden's head. I was fucking shot. Oh! That's my fault. I'm stupid. Hello? Why is this dude just sitting here? No? Wait, why? Wait, he is? Wait, these are zombified. Wait, why are they just... That was really weird. Alright, so as you said, the military outfit should be up here. So let me see about that, grabbing that. Oh, it's up there. I see it. There you go, Scat 9. Oh, okay. Yeah, I wasn't looking up that far. Dude, no wonder I never saw it before. Why, why would I be looking up that high? Overall, yeah, this is uh, this is really good. Um, and even though this is, really isn't helpful, I'm just going to put this 25% <laughs> in there. All right, well, time to go to Yantar. Hopefully, this won't be too bad because the ecologist should be my friends. Oh, crap, dude. There's, like, literally a guy right there. Oh, are you kidding me? Nope. Are, are you kidding me? Why are there freaking mercenaries? There's mercenary. No, go ahead and kill me. Go ahead, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Come on. Why are there mercenaries here? That is honestly so stupid. I, I w went and get this outfit just for them to be mercenaries. That's crazy. So let me swap back. There we go. Now they're my friends again. There we go. With this off, I'm now Unisig. All right. Now they know I am their friend, right? All right. Well, now they're all friends with me because they realize that I'm friendly. Who did they even kill? What were they shooting at? All right, so I know the exit is right here, 
but I kind of want to go over there and see how close I can get to them without them realizing because the armor's at 79%. So uh, yeah, let's just let's just go see. Why not? I just want to know. Am I like, is 80% enough to where I can just like walk right in or no? Hello everyone. I am your pal, your best friend. Hello. Okay. Well, there's the bar at the bottom. Oh, it's at two or three. So they are kind of suspicious at me already. But they're not super suspicious, actually. I mean, I'm gonna, here, what if I get like pretty close? Like I'm gonna, I'm gonna, how about this? If I talk to him, it's at four, five. Oh, okay, okay, now they're getting suspicious. Okay, so I can talk to them really quickly. And in other words, at 80%, I could do quest right now actually for them because all I gotta do is get close enough to turn it in and then just like walk away. Cause yeah, they, they're not bothering with me right now. They don't seem to think I'm that suspicious. Take to the delivery quest and steal the items. Oh my God, you are right. You are so right. Give, give me that, deliver the package. Oh, of course they give me like the tiniest package though. That's kind of funny, unpack. Oh, it gave me a uh, freaking anti-radiation drugs and an adrenaline injector. You know what? Not bad. All right, well to aggro prom we go, which actually might be easier. Bro, are you kidding me? I see the fires on down here. Are, who has the fire on? Who is it? It's a loner. Bro, why? I think it's just one though. Are you kidding me? Oh no, it's two. Oh, really? There's another guy here? Dude, I can't even see him. Where is he? There you go. Get destroyed, loser. All right, Shaq, you are gonna be my uh, first home, my first bed. All right, let's sleep till morning. Where is the bed? See, actually, I should see real quick if there is anything in here. Nothing in there. What about the boxes? No. Nope. Okay. Well, uh, I wouldn't consider this a bed, but okay. And it gives me a uh, overcast day. Always fun. Oh, are you serious? Did that like just appear out of nowhere? Was that one of those ones that blink in and out of existence? Cause I 100% didn't see that. By the way, I mentioned this before, but um, I might as well mention it again. Uh, if I could get about 200 more dollars, I'd feel a lot more confident in buying a new GPU. Um, cause like if I were to buy a new GPU right now, I'd basically be like broke, broke. Uh, but I could resell my current GPU, which isn't that bad. The issue is I don't know how long it would take to currently resell my new GPU. So, Hey, if anyone wants to donate a dollar, I, I do have links in the description. Oh, okay. I wasn't expecting a squad of them to be like right there. I almost like ran right into them and they would probably tell, <laughs> be able to tell my disguise. Yeah, dude, there's a lot of milk. Dude, how many guys are here? I feel like having my weapon put away would confuse them more because it's like, bro, where's your gun? Okay, so there's some dead military here. Oh, wait, that's a dead bandit too. What in the world? Ooh, our first grenade, dude, let's go. You have no idea how helpful that one singular grenade is. Ooh, okay, so there are military over there. Good, good, good. So we should be safe to just go through the transition zone, assuming they don't get in my way. Oh, here's the uh, prototype detector. Um, I'm just gonna leave it because if I take it, that's five kilograms. So I'll grab it on my way back. Is that, a, is that another dead ecologist? Yeah, it is, but they probably already looted him. Yeah, there's a lot of patrols going on, which is interesting. Oh my God. Okay, I, I, I thought this guy wasn't gonna have that much stuff. Wait, 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 why is it showing that I'm suspicious right now? Wait, who sees me? Huh? I don't see anyone in front of me. Do you see someone? I don't, I see the fires on, but I don't see no one. Oh, there is a guy here. It's a, okay. That's interesting. Bro, I didn't even see him. Holy crap. But hey, I'm, I'm glad they're, they're guarding here. Ooh, strong energy drink. Let's go. I'm drinking that literally right now. Just immediately so we can run. All right. So from here, now we can go down to Corden. And then from here, I got to kind of like hug this railroad track and then go down there. So uh, what's the bets? Are we going to have something else stupid happen? Or are we going to be able to just make it down there easy peasy now? All right. I'm glad there's no one ever here. I don't know why the military don't guard right here, considering they know this is another path to Corden, but you know, whatever. Oh, wow. Um, great. So that's not exactly what I was thinking the weather was going to do, but uh, actually here, let's do our trait points while we hear everything shooting. 
Here's the thing, Medic is kind of OP because it literally gives you 10% of the total health and radiation restored as like a super quick boost. So this thing's like kind of overpowered. I would take Lone Stalker, but I think Medic would be the smart idea. I'll, oh, I was about to say, I hear someone walking. Uh, okay, dude, there's military everywhere, holy. I don't think I've ever seen this many military patrolling around. Like they're everywhere, man. Also, it's funny, I said that they don't ever guard that other entrance, but here they are guarding this one. All right, as long as I stick to up here, there's always, literally always, um, military at the bridge in Redone, I'm pretty sure. So we should be pretty good. Yeah, as long as I don't get like super close to them, they should be just like chill with me passing through. I just need to walk past them and don't get super close to them. Now, I do kind of want to go all the way down here to the train because normally there's medical supplies on top of the train. So just really quickly, I want to check it out. I just heard dogs. I hear them, but I don't see them. That truly is the story of my life with these games. All right, train. Hopefully you have something on top of you because otherwise I came over here for nothing. There's sometimes also stuff on the ground right here. It doesn't look like it. Uh Oh, there's a Hercules. Let's go. In my situation, that's actually perfect. It's a bit annoying that there's nothing else here, though, because normally there is. But you know what? A Hercules, I'll accept it. Is that the dog? Yeah. It's, like, so hard to see it moving. I don't know how that looks on, like, YouTube. But, like, for me, it's like a freaking red pixel just moving around. I was like, what in the world is that? Oh. I think it just fried itself. All right, game. Let's go to Darkscape. And I am praying. I am literally praying right now. That there is a car on the other side. Please give me the car spawn. Woo, we're in Darkscape. My favorite place. Totally. I don't remember where exactly the car can spawn. I just remember it's like sometimes like right here at the entrance somewhere close by. Yeah, what I was going to say is normally like sometimes freedom spawn like right here. I've had them be right there. I heard some melee in Darkscape. Wait, Mercs heard me? Hello? Okay. Maybe, maybe it's Mercs to my left. Also, how did they hear me melee them? Oh, yeah, now I remember. Yeah, the, the car can be to the... Oh. Who am I getting shot at by? Huh? Oh! Well... Dude, who's spraying at me? I, I Dude, I'm so confused right now. I don't even see anyone. Dude, I don't even see who's shooting at me. <laughs> well, yeah, wait, wait, wait. There's people right there. Wait, it's Renegades? I was wondering who was shooting at me, okay? I did not think it was a Renegades. That is such random BS, dude. Renegades, really? Let me just see if I can sneak past them, honestly. I really don't want to deal with them. That's so stupid. I was like wondering who in the world would be here. Freaking Renegades. We'll be fine. Just keep our headlamp on. Nope. Oh, dude, he really got me right there. Nope, I'm just going to keep running. We'll, we'll be fine. We'll be fine because there will totally be a vehicle over here, right? That is why we'll be fine, because there's gonna be a vehicle over here. It's supposed to be able to spawn like right next to this rock over here. Yeah, the vehicle's not here. Uh, that's unfortunate. Well, I had a feeling the game wasn't gonna be nice to me. So uh, yeah, let's just start our run. It's gonna take us a while, but that's okay. I hear dogs, I don't mind if it's dogs. That's fine by me. Oh, they're chasing flesh. Oh, it's boars. Yeah, you guys can keep chasing boars. I'm just going to keep going this way. Into the road for you, my friend. Oh, who did Unisa kill, I wonder? Hello? Why is the flesh coming after me? I didn't do nothing. Oh, great. Oh, okay. We're okay. Just out of ammo. Oh my god, are my eyes deceiving me? I think I see a building in front of us. I wonder who the Unisig are killing right now, because they keep saying, like, your trouble's over, buddy. Like, who are they killing? Oh, thank goodness for Hercules. It wasn't too bad to run over here, because with Hercules, we basically have infinite stamina right now. So, so nice. Oh my god, we freaking made it. Oh my god. Oh, they killed a bunch of free stalkers. That's interesting. 
Yep, so here they are, deep in here. There's all, there's only three of us. Oh, four, sorry. Uh, so we made it after all. What's next, Commander? That's right, and then you just spam all this, and you're say, asking him a, a million questions. No more questions. And then chow. There you go, intelligence. Mark new location on PDA. Which means, guess what? We gotta go all the way back up to Dead City. Uh, we gotta go all the way up to Dead City. Oh, uh, isn't that hilarious, guys? Isn't that the funniest thing you've ever heard? That's right. The only reason we came down here was to start this quest line. But all that running is gonna be for the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully you'll enjoy the rest of my Unisig playthrough. See you.